a huge honour for me to, to represent and uh, manage a club with a tradition, the size of Everton Football Club. Um, I can't wait to get started. Um, I always had uh, a great feeling whenever I played against Everton as a player, playing at Goodison, felt the atmosphere, felt the passion of the fans and um, yeah, very hungry to get started. So there's so many different facets of the football club that, that reached out to you, that appeal to you? Yeah, for sure. I think there are certain clubs in, um, in England as a young boy growing up and as a player and now as a, as a manager, but when you, you go into the stadium, you can feel the, the, the passion that the fans have for their club. Um, very intense. Um, I always, at times, found it difficult when that passion was, was against you in, in a positive way, obviously, for Everton. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm very much looking forward to representing that on, on their side. Um, and they will 100% get the, the passion that they give when they watch their team. I'll try and bring that as a manager. It was a meticulous recruitment process. What did you take from the conversations that you had with the owner, the chairman and the board? Well, it was very positive and I think from my point of view to have such open conversations with, with the owner, with the board, to try and sell my, my vision for what I can bring to the club. I think you expect a meticulous process with the club, uh, the size of Everton Football Club. Um, but as I say, I'm very uh, pleased that um, they've uh, given me the role of managing the club. I will do it with all my heart, with all my passion and bring that. But yeah, the process was as it should be, and I'm very pleased to be here. Did their passion come through clearly as well? Yes, very much. Passion and ambition. You know, I think it's, uh, you can see that. I could see that from the outside looking in. But when you have those clo uh, conversations close up, it's great to feel that. I hope they felt my ambition and, and how hard I want to work to, to bring it all together as much as I can. So, yeah, really positive talks. Did the chairman and the owner give you an idea of their long-term vision for the football club? Yes, they did. Um, I think the most important thing that we, we all know that we have to focus on is the short term to get ahead of ourselves. But yes, we know uh, uh, the new stadium that's coming. We know where this club wants to be and where we want to get to. Uh, but we know first and foremost probably the challenges that are in front of us right now in terms of league position. Uh, we have an FA Cup game next week. And so I want to get to work very quickly on that to, mm -hmm. to, to deal with the short term. And of course, in, in the back of our minds is always the long term vision of the club.